Hey guys, back with another video and today I am dyeing my hair. I got myself some bags right here just in case I make a mess. As you can tell, I'm not wearing makeup right now. I went to bed, I know. I'm used to that, but <sighs> my last day with brown hair. So for the longest time, actually, I've never dyed my hair, so all my life I've had brown hair. It's kind of like interesting color. It's not my beautiful natural brown. It's just kind of weird since summer. And I cut it a lot to like keep it healthy, but like I still have some interesting colors. Randomly, it looks orange sometimes, and I'm like. Today, I'm going to be dyeing my hair and I'm going for a violet soft black. Yeah. For Christmas, um, I got hair dye. And I've been asking my parents for the longest time, can I do hair dye? And they got, I got hair dye for Christmas. We are doing this. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's get on with this. My first time, so I don't know really what I'm doing, but okay. Yeah, so we're gonna do this. So the case looks like this. Um, it's mostly for brown hair. That's what I need. I'm supposed to pour this stuff inside the bottle. And oh my gosh, this stuff stinks so bad. My sister's gonna come and help me later. JK, she's so, not. So, it's going to the dark color. And it's a violet soft black, so this will be interesting. I got my gloves and instructions. And inside, I have a bottle, and it has some conditioner stuff in it. My sister takes forever, so I guess I'm just gonna do it by myself. Ah! Here's the serum. I'm finished applying it. Um, it's made such a mess. I put it in a bag because my shirt is destroyed. Some stuff all over it. And I accidentally wiped my forehead with it, so my eyebrows look like <laughs> I went like this. And I didn't know it was on the back of my gloves, so um, <laughs> my forehead is kind of. Um, Painted. We'll see how this goes. It smells terrible. Try to breathe as less amount of, of it as you can. Yeah. My poor destroyed shirt. Also, wear clothes that you don't care about. I don't really care about this shirt, but I still feel bad that it's um, painted. So, um, the first time it wasn't as dark as the picture, but I just figured out something that you were supposed to wait for this thing to turn dark. Like, I wait, I, it was light pink when I started. So I did it when it was light pink, so that's why my hair looked so light. So now I have to wait again. Ooh. And now I gotta do it again. So that got on my face. Yep. So guys, I just got finished washing my hair. Um, we'll see how it turns out. It's not the <laughs> well, less color I'm stuck with for a while. Guys, here's the second attempt. It's much better than the first. Uh, it's a lot darker, 
which makes more sense, like the picture. And it looks more purpley. But once again, it's not like the color on the box. It's a little bit more cherry. A little bit. It's a little bit more cherry than the box. It's not that purple. It is more red than purple. So it's like a cherry purple. And yeah, so it's really nice. Um, it's like a dark, dark, dark brown. Technically, I guess I am still considered a brunette, I guess, if this is not black, but it's still good. I mean, I would probably recommend the color if you're a first, if you're a beginner like me. Nothing too dramatic. It is nice. It is amazing. Also, I accidentally dyed my eyebrows. I don't know what happened to my eyelashes though, but who knows. Thank you all for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed watching my interesting experience with hair dye. But yeah, I, I dyed my hair. It has a hue to it now. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Happy New Year's. Thanks for watching this. And for all those who can't really tell the color, I am going to do a photo shoot. And I will show you guys what it actually looks like. Seeing my other videos, you'll see that I had brown hair. Well, now I have dark brown hair with a purplish slash reddish hue. Let me know if I'm still considered a brunette, so I don't really know either. Bye!